releases iOS 8.4 at the end of this month, you will get, as we said, the Apple Music. And according to Mac rumors, you will also get a fix for the iMessage bug that crashes Macs, iPhones, and even Apple Watches. And we've been reporting on this bug for a few weeks. If someone sends you a specific string of Unicode characters, your app will quit and sometimes your device will crash. Apple has published workarounds that include turning off notifications on your lock screen and asking Siri to read your messages for you. But those who've installed the beta of iOS 8.4 claim that the permanent fix is on its way. And alas, iOS users are learning what Windows users have known for decades, and that is that bugs are a lot like weeds. One gets fixed and another one pops up in its place. Security researcher Gian Sosik writes that a bug in the iOS Mail app could allow a hacker to load remote HTML content, replacing the content of an original email message in order to create sophisticated and familiar looking pop-ups that ask for passwords, login data, and other personal or financial information. So be careful where you enter your personal information. Your Apple device does not make you immune to the bad guys. And would you watch an ad in exchange for free power for your electric car? A company called Volta thinks you will, and so do all the investors who just forked over $7.5 million in new financing. In total, the company has raised $12.5 million in equity and project financing. VentureBeat reports that Volta's EV charging stations are free to the user and free to the companies who own the land where the charging stations are built. And Ford, Forbes says that the only people paying are the advertisers, and according to Volta, it appears to be worth it to them to support free electricity. This summer, Volta will release an app that will help electric car owners find their charging stations and notify them when they've reached their two to three hour limit. Now, Tesla owners currently have their own free charging stations, but not everyone drives a Tesla, sadly. And speaking of Tesla, today in Elon Musk news, the SpaceX uh, CEO finally, he officially wants to rebuild the internet in space. Musk is petitioning the FCC for permission to launch a constellation of 4,000 cheap satellites into space in order to beam high-speed internet signals to remote areas. We reported this back in January when it was just a rumor, and now it appears to be true. Facebook had a similar space internet plan, but earlier this week we told you Zuckerberg thought it was too expensive, to which Elon Musk just shrugged and apparently said, I have enough money to do anything. Now, if you're lucky enough to get invited to a Google Ventures barbecue, you might get to see a headless robot dog dancing. That is a cute robot dog. Can we see him dancing? Oh yeah, there he is. I don't know why they never have heads. Very cute. But am I the only one thinks that this, who thinks that this dancing headless robot dog is intended to hide something? It's like the magic of Google Photos. Look, we're going to let you store all your photos for free and we'll even automatically add filters and create stunning musical creations from your pictures. Meanwhile, we are mining them for every last shred of personal information that you have left.